This is my house. I think it is a beautiful house. I have been living here for 30 years. But you know, the house, you always not need some work to be done, need some maintenance. But working with the right person is very, very important. 2014 Mother's Day. Okay, we went out for a great Mother's Day brunch. We came home. I noticed by the garage, one of the corner, there's some of the, like a lot of palm leaves or whatever. I still did not know what's going on. Impacted here, and the tree was sitting on that elevation there. And on the back. On the back side, yeah. The tree came from that yard and was land basically was sitting right on top of here. Actually, the palm tree itself is about 30 feet tall. The trunk is about what, five feet or six feet wide smashing one corner of the garage door. Yeah, it was large. Huge, yeah, huge. Yeah, it was, it was at least four, five feet, four, five five feet, feet wide. Feet. No, yeah. it's more than that. I thought that's about when I, when they were taking it out, so they could not handle it. Yeah. Yeah. No, it was big. They took it out with a crane. So that was the area that was impacted there. So we opened the garage door. I found the car was uh, almost can be totaled, okay, because the ceiling, the plaster, whatever, all fell through to the car. So that's how it is. Beautiful Mother's Day after brunch. Okay, so definitely we need a contractor. So I have a lot of resources, some of them bad experiences, some of them maybe decently okay, but basically I was referred to OP, uh, Inline the Restoration Company, and I interviewed them. Somehow I have a good feeling, and they show me that I don't know. I was just persuaded by the feeling when I interviewed this guy. You have a kind of a good presence. You're right. Uh, he gives people the confidence. I'm telling yeah, you, yes. It's comforting. No, I really tell you that, yes. You don't get frustrated in working with them or communicate with them. That's the most important part also, other than the good job and stuff. So, Rosa, for us, you know, you were one of the, the nicer homeowners we've dealt with, but I also know that you were one of the most business-minded ones, too. In a way, yes. Well, no, I mean, I, I know because of the different businesses that you've owned. And, um, and once we started to share about that, I knew, okay, that this is the type of homeowner that, you know, schedules, communication is going to be very important. Because there's no construction is perfect. And then basically during the course, do I have a little issue? Yes. But whenever I brought up to OP, he has he doesn't even debate or say anything. He will just come over, look at it, and get it uh, fixed. And those all happen shortly, okay? And so I, I would say the whole process I'm very pleased with. You're a sweetheart. Oh, by the way, there's very rare after the construction you're still able to exactly. talk to your contract. No, I know, I know. Okay, even shaking the <coughs> hand. That's so true. That's so true.